welcome to our video today I will teach you how to create that pop tag Instagram pop tag that you can see in the videos such as Jake Paul so yeah let's go right into it so first of all we'll need Premiere and we will need Photoshop now Photoshop we're going to create a rounded rectangle first and let's get right into it so first of all rounded rectangle something like that not really big and make it full black with the fill uh, actually make it a second a black which is this here color and go to the stroke and cancel the stroke we don't need the stroke and right now position it in the middle like that right now go again to this here section hold left click and go to polygon tool click in this middle part and make number of slides three this is actually triangle so click OK and now go to the move tool and control T and now hold shift and with left click just position this like that now what we want to do is just going and make it like that and click apply and now just drag it uh, in the middle like that and with arrow keys you can uh, create however you want deep uh, rectangle to go let me just center this like that I think this is kind of center so make it like that so right now we're going to type in with the text so at Jake Paul we're going to create that like this like that so we actually have uh, depends on your name you will have to adjust a little bit so as you can see Jake Paul is not that big of a name so we're going to round rectangle and make it like this and make polygon here a uh, rectangle like that in the middle like that and now we're going to group all this by clicking left click on the last layer and holding shift and clicking left click on the first layer control G control E and we have one group right here we're going to center that like that and we're going to file export save for web PNG 24 save it and we're going to say pop tag Jake Paul right now we're going in uh, Premiere Pro and basically what we're going to do is file and we're going to import and actually not import we're going to file and we are going to open actually you can just go in on your desktop and just drag it right here as you can see we're going to close that up and we're going to just drag it to the timeline right here and drag it like that right now we have a pop tag as you can see let me just go again here is the pop tag now the pop tag needs to be motion tracked now I, I already made a video about motion tracking but I will make another video so first of all uh, click on this Jake Paul and just drag it so we're going to click on this and we're going to actually position it by clicking on this toggle animation tool and right now we can double click this and uh, we will have this kind of a motion track tracking uh, kind of a like a circle and now we want to go to pop tag we want to selection tool V and we have to do is drag it under his chin like that and right now we're going to motion track we're going a little bit up with the frames like that and we're going to motion track make it a little bit down again motion tracking a little bit up because he made that face like that we're going a little bit down again like that so let me just play a video so you can see what we were working on as you can see it isn't really the best motion tracking but you can you know you can create however you want the motion tracking is really amazing thing that you can do so this is basically how to create that pop tag and yeah basically you can create this in all your videos uh, it's amazing thing that you can do and also motion tracking is a uh, really beautiful thing in Adobe Premiere Pro and I thank you guys for watching this has been it so thank you guys for watching drop a like down below if you liked it and if it helps you